missile, a rocket propelled weapon designed to deliver an explosive warhead with great accuracy at high speed. Missiles vary from small tactical weapons that are effective out to only a few hundred feet to much larger strategic weapons that have ranges of several thousand kilometers. Cruise missiles are generally associated with land attack operations but have also an important role as an anti-ship weapon. Namaste everyone. Welcome to another fascinating video from Brahmat. Today, we'll do a comparison on America's Tomahawk missile and India's Brahmos missile. Before that, if you're new to the channel, then please subscribe and hit that bell icon. Okay, let's begin. In this video, we'll compare both missiles based on the following aspects. Missile type, engine, operational range, speed of the missile, warhead capability, accuracy. Number 1. Missile Type Tactical gated missiles are generally categorized according to the location of the launch platform and targets, such as air-to-air, -air, air to surface, surface to air. So, Tomahawk missile is a long-range all-weather subsonic cruise missile. But when it comes to BrahMos missile, BrahMos is a cruise missile, air-launched cruise missile, anti-ship missile, land attack missile, surface-to-surface -surface missile. It is a joint venture between the Russian Federation's NPO, Machino Strovenia, and India's Defense Research Development Organization, DRDO. The Tomahawk was initially produced in the 1970s by General Dynamics as a medium to long range low altitude missile that could be launched from a surface platform. Number 2 Engine There is a major difference in the engines used in both missiles. If you look at the Tomahawk missile, it has William International F107 WR402 turbofan plus a solid fuel rocket booster. By the way, Tomahawk missile uses a TH dimer fuel. Now you might be wondering what is a TH dimer is. TH dimer means tetrahydromethylcyclopentadiene dimer. Well, let me put it this way. The stuff is highly flammable. But the Tomahawk Block 4 variant is powered by a William International F415 cruise turbofan engine and an ARC MK135 rocket motor. The propulsion provides a subsonic speed of 880 km per hour. But when you look at BrahMos, it has a two-stage propulsion system. BrahMos uses solid fuel rocket booster for initial acceleration and liquid fuel ramjet for sustained supersonic cruise. The first stage is solid rocket booster, which uses ammonium perchlorate as oxidizer and atomized aluminum powder as fuel. The second stage is liquid ramjet that uses a hydrocarbon fuel. This provides BrahMos a supersonic speed of Mach 3 plus, which is 3704 km per hour. India is also working on a new variant that has a speed of Mach 7 plus. Number 3. Operational Range When it comes to operational range, Tomahawk missile have an upper hand. Let's have a look at the range of a Tomahawk missile. Right now, Five blocks of Tomahawk missiles are in operation, Block 3, Block 2, and Block 4, ranging from 1300 km to 2500 km. Okay, now let's take a look at the operational range of the BrahMos missile. Right now, three types of BrahMos missiles are in operation and production. Surface and sea platform, range 290 km. It has been upgraded to 800 km. Air platform, 
range 400 kilometers. A new variant of 1500 kilometers is under development. And last, export. This is the variant that India exports to other countries. The range of this variant is 290 kilometers. Number 4. Warhead Capability Tomahawk missile can carry both conventional and nuclear warheads. When it comes to nuclear warheads, Tomahawk can carry W-80 warheads. W-80 is a low to intermediate yield two-stage thermonuclear warhead. Same as Tomahawk, Brahmos is also capable of both nuclear and conventional warheads. But unlike Tomahawk, Brahmos use a conventional semi-armor piercing warhead or a nuclear warhead weighs 300 kilograms. All warheads for Brahmos missile are manufactured by Indian Ordnance Factories. Number 5. Accuracy Accuracy of a missile is one of the highest factor that affect the performance of a missile. The CEP of a Tomahawk missile is 5 meters and the CEP of a Brahmos missile is 1 meter. Confused? How do we calculate the accuracy of a missile? To understand that, we need to know what is CEP. The full form of CEP is Circular Error Probable or Circle of Equal Probability. Different countries use different full forms, but the concept is same. CEP is a measure of weapon systems precision. Okay, have you guys seen a dartboard? Same, take a look at this image. The red dot in the middle is the target and each circle around is 1 meter. If a missile hit the middle circle, then you can say the CEP is 1 meter. Or you can say pinpoint accuracy. But when it comes to Tomahawk, the accuracy is 5 meters. So Brahmos is 5 times more accurate than Tomahawk. Okay, let's do a briefing. Brahmos and Tomahawk, they are both made for entirely different tasks. First, the Tomahawk is a subsonic cruise missile and its equivalent would be India's nearby missile. Secondly, the Brahmos is the world's first and only maneuverable supersonic cruise missile and also the fastest. It also has a great range up to 290 km to 400 km and the 1500 km variant is also under development. Please understand that supersonic missiles are generally in 90 to 150 km in range. Do you know Brahmos can bypass even the current NATO ship protection system like Aegis? The threat is so serious that United States Navy has commissioned multiple projects to get equivalent missile systems either indigenously or buy it along with better ship protection system. This makes Brahmos a unique piece of weaponry. That's all I have for today. If you like this video, then please like, subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell icon. I'll be back with another video soon. Till then, Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.